Okay, for this video, I'm going to show you how to replace your LMB. Your LMB may look a little different than this, but the main idea will remain the same. There is no need to adjust the dish left or right, up or down, or anything if you're replacing just the LMB. What we want to do, first of all, is get a uh, marker, like a uh, marker like this one, and find the center line of the LMB. Well, no, notice that this one has a little line right there in the middle. I've marked it with my uh, Sharpie and then I'm also going to mark right above the LMB on the bracket itself where the LMB mark is. So now I have a mark on the bracket and the mark on the LMB and I'm also going to mark the distance of the LMB top to bottom between the bracket. You See that mark I made? Alright, the next thing that you want to do now is grab a screwdriver, put your finger underneath one of these brackets if your bracket is different and it splits in the middle, then you have to take out the bolt from the side. Also make a mark where that center line was on that bracket. Very good. Now, so on this, in this case, with this particular bracket, I want to put my finger underneath the bolt and start taking off the screw. By doing this, you'll hold the nut from falling off of the little space there and it won't fall down the roof, down the grass, or into the gutter and uh, you won't have to worry about loosening it. So now loosen the other side of the bolt too, just loose enough where I can just do this little twist action right there. See that mark? Okay. What I want to do next is grab the new LMB that I have already marked. Notice that the arrow right there and the zero are marked and there's, I put a little black line in the middle just to get an idea of where that line is. So I'm going to do the little installation now. I'm going to put the LMB underneath and kind of just spin it together. You may need to take out that bracket completely if it's dried up. If it's really dried up, you may want to replace it. Give us a call at uh, or visit our website. Now what I want to do is compare the distance back here with the new LMB and match that and now put that center line right there in the middle you see how that matches the bracket the bracket line is right there and the line on the LMB is there so now I will tighten down the screws all you have to do is hold it tight enough where it doesn't spin then you'll take your, your wire and screw it back on there and you should be ready to go thank you for watching